Six accidents and one fire claimed the lives of seven persons at the weekend. The latest accident involved Colonel Husbands, 46, of Carmichael Street, Georgetown. He passed away on Monday after his motorcycle collided with a car driven by another man at Cummings and Church Street, Georgetown. Husbands, who worked at Atlas Security Services, Inc., was the driver of motorcycle CM2986. Based on the investigation, police said the car was proceeding north along the western lane of Cummings Street while the motorcycle was proceeding east on Church Street. As the car and motorcycle approached the intersection, the driver of the car allegedly failed to stop at the stop sign and collided with the motorcycle. Earlier in the morning, the police reported the death of Karan Duman, a 17-year-old painter of Bushlot Village. He reportedly lost control of his motorcycle and collided with a Guyana Power and Light GPL utility post. Also on Monday, the Guyana Police Force says Aziz Gulab, the young man who died in an accident at Waweta Main Trail, North Rupununi Region 9, was speeding when he lost control of his motorcycle. Police headquarters said the young man was at Arunapota ground imbibing alcohol with friends and watching a football game, but he left at about three hours. Police said he was speeding when he lost control of the motorcycle and ran off the trail. One day earlier on Sunday, a 26-year-old man of Hibernia Essequibo Coast, Region 2, died after he crashed his motorcycle and ended up inside a trench. Dinesh Williams was picked up in an unconscious state and rushed to the Saudi Public Hospital, where he succumbed to his injuries. And on Saturday, a 20-year-old man died hours after he was run over by a car while lying on the Zeeberg Public Road, West Coast, Demerara. Dead is Warren Jr. Thomas, a resident of Area G, the Willem Public Road, West Coast, Demerara. According to a police report, Thomas was lying on the southern parapet of the public road when the driver drove over Thomas. Police said the driver fled the scene of the accident. Meanwhile, there were unofficial reports of an accident in Latham Region 9 that claimed the life of a woman named Shemel Lindy. Also, sat among the reports of death was a fire on Monday that destroyed a building that houses a Chinese restaurant and was home to five persons at Mackenzie Linden. Zhang, a Chinese national, reportedly perished. Four other persons managed to escape through a window, as seen in a video of the fire scene.